Welcome back, my friends. I've been waiting for the segment. Get ready to be entertained. It is time to sit back and enjoy the sights and sounds of Bay City Western's first musical in over eight years. I am so excited for you guys. Here to tell us all about Once Upon a Mattress. It's my pleasure to have Chase and Claire joining me. Thanks for being here, guys. How are you? Great. Thanks for having us. I know you took time out of your busy practice schedule to come here, so mm -hmm. thank you so much for that. First, give us a little snippet about what is Once Upon a Mattress about? Once Upon a Mattress is a musical that was originally written in the 60s. It is a retelling of the classic uh, Princess and the Pea Tale. So it's a comedy. It's fun for all ages, and yeah. yeah. Okay, I have to know what characters you play. Who do you play? I play the minstrel. I'm the narrator of the story. Oh. Um, kind of just taking you through the journey yes. and telling you all the different characters. So you have that calm voice, the one that everyone just loves listening to. <laughs> I love that. Okay, so how about you? I am Queen Agravain. I am the villain of the story, oh. and I am the prince's mother, so I'm trying to stop him from getting married. Really? What do you enjoy about the characters that you play? that you really bring? What do you bring to your character? I really love the little mysterious vibe, how he's been oh. everywhere and how he can take and tell a story in yes. so many different ways. Oh, that's exciting. For me, I really enjoy, I've never played a villain before. I was so, gonna say, you're so sweet. Yeah. <laughs> that, that's probably nice to get out of your comfort mm -hmm. zone, right? Yeah, I just played a character who was really timid and now I get to play a character who's like really big, oh. really boisterous, and yeah. I'm excited to see this. Okay, so when is the musical? The musical is this upcoming next Thursday okay. and it goes from Thursday to Saturday all of the shows are at 7 p.m. and tickets are ten dollars. How can we get tickets? Um, you can get them at the door yeah. or online through okay. GoFan. Okay. And yeah, is that? I love awesome? it. It's also Western's 50th anniversary, so mm -hmm. you guys really want a sold-out show, yes. right? Yes. Yes. That is the goal. Yeah. So, why would you tell people, you know, just come out and see this because why? Because the cast and the crew has put a lot of work yeah. in. Me and Chase. We helped rebuild the theater program our sophomore oh, wow. year. So this show is kind of, it's our first musical for yeah. a while. To us, it's really, it's like entering a new era. Yeah. Where Western's entering a new era with the 50th yes. anniversary. And now, oh, I am so sorry. I've no. got like a cold. No, um, you're fine. I'm, I'm so glad that it's so personal to you, though. Yeah. And it, you're seeing your your hard work come to fruition, which is mm -hmm. so wonderful. After eight years yeah. to be back on stage, mm -hmm. that must be so exciting. Yeah. We put a lot of work yeah. into it, and oh. it's very exciting yes. to see what's happening what's with the happening. program. Yeah. yeah. Well, okay, everyone, go out and please see this. Our, we will have all the information about this in our hot link section at WNEM.com, how to get tickets, the price, and everything. No worries. Thank you for being here and break a leg. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Got this. Yeah, I'm so excited for you guys. If you have any ideas on what you would like to see on our show, you can send them to us at WNEM 4 p.m. news at WNEM.com. Just use the subject 4 p.m. news spotlight.